wait a minute, boys and girls. I think I see our B. That's right, our school-wide expectations. Be responsible, be respectful, and be safe. And our third through sixth grade teachers and students to complete the uh, stu student panoramic survey. That uh, window will close on Friday and we are looking for 100%. So teachers, if you still have students who have not completed that survey, uh, please reach out to them during your um, office hours or last few minutes of the day and ask them to complete that survey. Uh, I did, direct, did send directions in your email of how to um, retrieve that survey. So please review if, if needed. Um, also, we are still in our count window. So um, any students who have not shown up since our count day for all teachers, please reach out to those students, um, try to get them in class so that we get counted. We wanna make sure we are at 100% for our count day numbers. Um, if you need support, as usual, you can reach out to Ms. Um, Gray, Ms. Dickinson, and she will support you as well. So I'm going to now turn this over to Ms. Davis. Thank you so much, Ms. Jaywar. All righty, so it's that time, the right wheel of fortune for the month of February. So boys and girls, you want to be on the lookout. Your teacher will let you know which student will be the student of the month for February. And remember, every student um, on the wheel will receive free Wendy's ice cream for a year. And then one special student whose name gets selected on the wheel will get pizza delivered to their home. Also this Friday, mom, dad, grandma, auntie, can you hear me? Yes, we have a little short meeting this Friday. The attendance team, as you can see, are listed here that will be there. We just want to let you know as a Charles Wright attendance team that we're here for you. We have a lot of supports. We have wraparound services, and we just want you to know what's going on. And then we want to get your feedback of how we can help you even more. So that's going to be like a 20 minute meeting this Friday. Look for the flyer. All right. I'm going to turn it over to Ms. Dickerson. Good morning, everyone. Again, our daily percentage for yesterday, we were at 76%. The classrooms that had 90% or more was Ms. Mako and Ms. White. Give them a round of applause. And I send it back to you, Ms. Davis. Thank you so much. All righty. Now we have boys and girls. Guess what? It is the hundredth day celebration for school. Hundred days of school for kindergarten, and we wanted to give them a special shout out. So we have a quick video that we would like to show to uh, to honor our kindergarten's 100 day celebration. You remember boys and girls when you were in kindergarten and you had this? So let's give it up for them. 100 days, 100 days, 100 days of school today. So clap and sway and say hooray. Hooray! of school today let's count come on everybody 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 days all right 100 days all right now we're going to have a moment in black history take it over donovan You're on mute. Thank you, Ms. Davis. Good morning, staff and students. And here are your daily bit of words of wisdom. So Jordan Truth traveled from place to place and spoke out against enslaving people and for women's rights. Touring a country, she challenged many people's false beliefs about race and gender. Even though she couldn't read or write, her thrilling speeches won 
her the respect of many educated people fighting for the rights of black people and women. That included President Abraham Lincoln, who met with her at the White House in 1864. And for today's words of wisdom, we have, don't be limited by other people's limited imagination. Wow, awesome. Don't be limited. Mae Jemison, the yes. first black female astronaut. Wow, thank you so much. Can you repeat that one more time? Don't be what? Le don't be limited by other people's limited imaginations. Awesome, thank you, Donovan. All right, take it over, Brene. Thank you, Ms. Davis. Good morning, staff and students. Please repeat the pledge after me. I am somebody. I may not look like everybody, but I am somebody. I feel like I am somebody. I look like I am somebody. I act like I am somebody. Everybody is somebody to somebody. Nobody but nobody can make me feel like a nobody. If you want to love somebody, then love me. If you want to help somebody, then help me. I am somebody. You are somebody. And don't you ever forget it. Oh, thank you, Brene. Thank you so much. And now we have Darian with the Pledge of Allegiance to our flag. Darian? Good morning. Thank you, Mrs. Davis. Good morning, staff and students. Please repeat after me. I pledge of allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and into the Republic for which we stand, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. With liberty and justice for all. All righty. Well, guess what? It's that time. We want to say thank you so much for spending this little time with us. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye.